is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this Wednesday, the 14th of Feb. Happy Valentine's Day, everyone. 38343 up $70 after a huge smash to the downside yesterday, holding pretty well. And if we're looking at this, you've got to consider that the SMHs, the semiconductors, up almost $4 at 203.27. That's telling us that this is a very select market. It's becoming more and more select and that there's kind of a rotation going on. And we've got to keep monitoring that because until the semiconductors start to pull back sharply and stay down every day after being a lower from an earlier rally, uh, this market still has some rotational strength. And you can see that because the S&P is up 28 at 49.81. You've got the QQQ. This is basically the NDX 100 trading vehicle, 431.43, up 285 after a really terrible session yesterday. Holding quite nicely, helped a little bit by the semis. IWM, the Russell 2000, trying to get something back today, up 251, 197.15. Gold, talk about getting, trying to get something back. Gold just can't get anything back. It's down eight, and if you're looking at the dollar, dollar is once again slightly higher. Uh, no, it's actually come down a little bit. Now it's down eight cents at 104.79. Bonds. Bonds are up 330 seconds, 118 and 230 seconds. Wow, looking terrible. And if you're looking at crude oil, crude oil has been rallying and it's it's together, it's this little triumvirate that I'm looking at. It's the dollar, it's bonds. It's really important that if this market is trying to find some stability, if crude oil, which is only up a little bit now, it's up 66 cents at 78.54, but if the dollar bonds bond yields, that is, and crude oil move higher, it's kind of going to put pressure on, and that's the pressure that I call dark news uh, cover, and we're looking at the uh, VIX index, and this is a problem. I didn't discuss this with my subscribers this morning. I meant to, and I completely forgot. Streaming up to almost 18, is now down at 14.37. That was too much too quickly, and that just tells me that there's, there's some internal strength there's a lot of uh, hysteria that keeps coming into the market, but it's brief, and then the market tries to stabilize. I'll be back for the Tiger Technician's Hour. Check out my opening call.